striking, we're going to talk about bait. Bait for hoop netting is super important. If you don't put bait in your hoop net, there's going to be nothing that's going to draw the lobsters into the net. Now, there's people that'll tell you you got to use chicken, you got to use cat food, you got to use salmon heads. Let me tell you something. A very, very good friend of mine is in the lobster business for a living. He's a commercial lobster fisherman. He studied the lobsters. The big long antennas on them are there to pick up the electrical force that's coming off the bait right when it starts to break down, when it starts to die. Everything has an electrical field around it. So what we've learned and what we found is the fresher the bait, the better. So as soon as that bait starts to break down, those lobsters can feel it in the water with those big long antennas and they start marching right to your bait. Now, commercial lobster fishermen, 90% of them are using a very small jar about that big to put their bait in.